Alrighty, hey there gamers, it's Carputing, and I'm coming back at you with another GameGenic opening, unboxing, and review. This product I paid for with my own money, bought it off Amazon. No discount codes, no affiliations. I have a few of these which I'll show off already, well a couple of them already. And uh, yeah, I'm just a very, very big fan of this product. So you can see tons of different ways you can store things in it. It's got nice, simple packaging. It comes in gray, black, blue, and red, to my understanding. So uh, most of their colors that they have, not all of them. So we'll get into it there. Just slice the, the opening. And let's, uh, let's see the overall fit, finish, quality of a uh, GameGenic dungeon 1100 plus deck box so oh. so game genic always has very good packaging i find i mean it's always it's in there good the the cardboard's a good quality it's got nice quality print on it i mean um once again no no sponsorship no affiliation but i am very happy with game genic's packaging always so Oh, this is the gray version nice nice just kind of average little different 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 palettes of gray some blacker some grayer so you open it you get in there it's it's a nice magnet uh lid so you can put it on the bottom like this and it'll kind of need a there you go and then now look that's all oh, that that'll come off but if it's sitting there you can just kind of have it like that and then you can have your, your deck box kind of take up less space. Sometimes you need to slide it a bit back and forth. I don't know, but that's that's like that. And then you've got all this space here, nice and simple, just for cards. So th this side ain't staying in too much right now. I don't know. Oh, I think I have it like slightly misaligned there. I don't know, but yeah, that looks a lot happier now. So that's uh that's how that that deck box work deck box works gamers so nothing too fancy about it but i will show you two that i have here filled up which is why it led to me getting a third so this is my most packed one <clears throat> i have in here double sleeved all these cards and these are nine commander decks i uh <clears throat> outlaws of thunder junction are these four and then uh I forget what, what five were were these, but anyways, you can see there's a bit of room for the uh, cards to slide around horizontally, that's okay. It's, uh, you can't really put them in sideways, but that's how that is. So you can fit kind of, I find, max 500, <clears throat> maybe plus an, an additional 40 tokens or so, and like a, a piece of paper. So I'd call this, um, yeah, probably about... 550 um double sleeved cards per side and it's it's not the it's not a super horrible tight fit it's kind of tight um but you can see when when you get four it definitely definitely leaves a bit of room so you can comfortably fit four um or easily without you know squishing the cards fit five fully sleeve double sleeved commander decks i use dragon shield perfect fit inners and dragon shield matte card sleeves um, so that is how this deck box is set up, and then I have another one that is half full here. And this is how I keep all my magic supplies and stuff. So I've got caffeine to stay awake, I've got, you know, Citadel black dry erase tokens, some, some dice and stuff. Um, all that good stuff. So overall, I do highly recommend this thing. I paid about uh, $74 after tax Canadian, like 66 67 before. Something like that Canadian for the gray box. These blue ones uh, go anywhere from like 100 bucks, 80 bucks. The price is all over with, uh, with the game, Genic. It's pretty high demand, not always in stock. So I don't really know exactly what the price is. Just go look online, look at some comparisons, find yourself something that's reasonable. And then uh, go pick up one of these. If you need a big deck box, you know, these are very well made, I, I find. I, I'm, I'm happy with them. So they fit a ton of cards. It's high quality. There's no loose threads or any of that. I, I feel like it's going to last forever. So they are on the expensive end, especially when you get as many game genic things as I do. But I do, uh, I do like the product and think it's worth it. So anyways, that's the convertible dungeon deck box. It's got plenty of uses. It's very versatile. No affiliation, no sponsorship. I'll throw a link to it in the description. Have a great day.